On the Health Watch tonight, here's something to chew on. Local researchers say low-carb diets cause people to burn more calories than other diets. Dr. Malika Marshall is here, and this was a large study conducted here in Massachusetts, and I think we knew that low-carb diets help with your weight, but burn calories. That's interesting. Right. This is new. Yeah. I mean, this was a study that was conducted by researchers at Boston Children's Hospital in conjunction with Framingham State University, and what they did was follow overweight volunteers who were given fully prepared meals for 20 weeks and they did blood tests and they weighed them and they did all kinds of things and they found that those on the low carb plan burned more calories than those on the high carb plan as many as 250 more calories a day now when people go on diets they often regain the weight in the first one or two years because it slows down the body's metabolism and you tend to burn fewer calories but this is a diet that might actually allow you to continue to burn calories and even maybe more calories and might help you maintain the weight loss. So low carb, a lot of meat. Low carb. Well, yeah, but you can do fish. You can do healthy proteins. It doesn't yeah. have to be what I know you're asking about. A lot of meat. A lot of bacon and steak. <laughs> it happens to all of us. You see someone you know, but you can't remember their name. This is like my life. <laughs> it leads you to believe that you're better at remembering faces than names, but new research says it's not true. Doctor, it says we're better at names than faces. How can this Which be? Which you would never think, right? No. You see someone, you're like, oh, shoot, I can't. And the it older we get, the worse it gets, right? But researchers in the UK found that it's actually easier for us to remember someone name than what they look like. Hmm. They asked 24 volunteers to memorize 40 pictures of strangers and paired that with random names and the volunteers consistently scored higher at remembering the names over the faces and even when they showed them celebrity faces and names they still were slightly better at recognizing the names over the faces. Now names are both written and spoken which might help sort of seal them in our memory but if you think you're bad at remembering names you're probably even worse at remembering faces. I mean I know my face is hard to forget but I have to say when I'm out and about nobody ever recognizes my face. They only recognize me if for example I give them a credit card and they go oh yeah. Oh, you're that doctor. Joanne, I always know who you are. <laughs> you too, Steve. Good to see you. <laughs> Lisa, over to you.